Hey guys, how's it going? It's Tuesday night, 27th of November. It's really cold here. It's about like minus 10 centigrade or so, minus 15 centigrade. It's only going to get colder. Anyways, uh, the reason I'm making this video is I just saw an article uh, about the England managerial position for the national team. And Jose Mourinho has expressed interest. First of all, let me just say, in America here, we would pronounce his name Jose, uh, as the Spanish pronunciation. As it is, he's Portuguese, so I'm not sure how the Portuguese would pronounce his name. I'm just going to pronounce it Jose, as that is how England uh, pronounces it. Of course, the England people also pronounce the city of Lyon, France, as Lyon, so who knows. <laughs> anyway, so, so getting back to that, uh, Jose Mourinho has been or has expressed interest in the England managerial position. Um, he could be using it for self-interest, uh, as a maneuver tactic to, uh, to uh, boost up his salary and, and other managerial positions that open up, you know, meaning that he has no actually real interest in taking this position, but just using it as leverage. So who knows, but you don't know. Um, also, there was a uh, Real Madrid's ex-manager, I believe, uh, Fabio Capello, Capello <clears throat> has expressed interest. Um, then you've had those who have who have distanced themselves, who have said, no, I'm not going to take it. That would include Sam Allardyce from Newcastle, which, of course, if any indication of how Newcastle is doing, is performing this year, that's probably wise that he refuses. Uh, Martin O'Neill. Um, hell of a manager. Um, of course, he still has a lot of work to do with uh, Aston Villa, but um, he wouldn't he wouldn't not be exactly the worst choice, and uh, I think he would do very well. In fact, um, but getting back to Jose Mourinho, I think he would be an excellent choice if he's if he's serious about it. If he's you actually, you know, you know, legitimately interested in the position and would want to take it and would accept a you know a salary that the FA, England FA, could afford, then I I think that would be great. I think he would do wonders for the team, especially in areas of bonding. Um, the one concern I would have is his his performance as Chelsea. I mean, they were god-awful boring at times to watch Chelsea. I mean, yeah, they won, they won, they won. I mean, they, they won two Premier League championships in a row, but... Uh, it's awfully boring to watch, but uh, hey, win's a win, I guess. Um, so I just thought I'd, you know, mention that, and you know, I'd appreciate your feedback if you, you had any uh, uh, choices. Uh, also, who has refused? Alan Kerbishley. Um He's currently at West Ham. Um, previously, I believe at Charlton. They move around so much these days. I don't even know. So, I mean, he has also refused. Um, he would be also an excellent uh, manager, I think. Um, so that's about it, I guess. So just let me know what you think about Jose Mourinho, uh, if he would be a good manager or not, or is there somebody else that hasn't been mentioned. Um, yeah, okay. So talk to you guys later. Bye.